Fashion Week asked me to take part in the 81 pound challenge. I was very excited because I knew that it was right up my alley. 81 pounds, that's the challenge. I can't believe we all throw that much away. No one is innocent either. Everybody is guilty of this. Everybody is in on this. I think you should feel bad if you're buying and throwing it away right away. There really is no need for new factory-made clothes anymore. It's all already here. We have enough stuff here already. People don't have a clue. They don't think about where their clothes come from. They don't question it. They literally look at it and they check how much it costs. It's the first thing they do. I mean, when you're dealing with that kind of an approach, it's really hard to open someone's eyes, but I think it's very important. And that's why we're doing this project, just to kind of let people know, like, this disposable life we're living is tragic. So stop doing it. That's the only way it stops, is if we stop buying it. We, I think, are more civilized than just throw away fashion. You can actually buy something that's already here and feel good about yourself just as easily. I love Value Village. Look at this cool thing. Mm, done. I found some of the best pieces in my wardrobe at Value Village. It's very what we're doing. To actually be able to make a collection with them is very exciting. These are definitely... Yes. <laughs> chop those all up into one piece. I've known Miriam LaRoche for years. We always knew we were going to work together. And when this came out, it was perfect. There's a lot of people working on this project, which makes it even more exciting. It's been a lot of fun working with our stylist, Alan Balsevich. Her ideas are magnificent, and she's also enthusiastic about my crazy ideas. Uh, yeah, let's take it. Yeah. It's gonna be tough. Are you eating clothing and textile? We got him back to the studio. This is how I work. And some of the stuff we picked, you know, you just had to salvage what was left. This is the cool part of that coat. Yeah, you're right. This is like before I go in for the lax. <laughs> you have to cut it apart from its bones. It almost felt like you were harvesting. We are pulling them out as they're on their way to the grave. Slashing it and washing it. It's always fun. A lot of times they just need a little something to make them perfect. I don't think you have to do much to this. It needs to be fringed so the crop isn't weird. I love leather. It lasts forever. It has a life force in it that woven fabric just doesn't. This is great. Oh, I kind of like that. The 70s and then the belt. <laughs> yeah, I kind of, I actually so like it. Cheap. <laughs> it is. It's so Yeah. So let's do this. Totally cool. Oh, let's do this. Yeah. Really cool. Look at that. It's very That's glam. Cheap as Okay. So now I can fringe this. People have come to expect the unexpected with my shows. How can we present it in a way that it's interesting and new? That's what's exciting, the big picture. I guess I wanted to create a fantasy that you would never expect to come out of Value Village. It's like when you put on a piece of clothing that you know is made to last, you can wear it, your essence goes inside of it, you hang it in your closet, you keep it, you love it, you hand it down to someone you love after you're done with it. Like that's the story a piece of clothing should have. I really want people to leave thinking about the next time they go buy something. I want them to think about where it was made, how much they're spending, do you think that's a fair price for whoever actually made this? And then, you know, if I can get that, then we're successful. 
of upcycling means making something old, like new again. So basically revamp it. It could be an idea, it could be a piece of clothing in this case, or it could be yourself. You know, change yourself for the better. And so it goes, you know, metaphorically and goes for the fashion show where we upcycle stuff. Um, to make something different and like um, perfect than like the others. <laughs> Where you take something and like make it into something more beautiful, I guess. Like create something that you want. And like, yeah. So upcycling means when you use a old piece of fabric or anything and you reuse it into something that's better. Upcycling means that you take something that is already made and nobody wants it anymore, so they put it to like you're gonna throw it away. And you just take it and you make something new and it makes it better and it's not wasteful anymore. And we're live. Produced by the colleagues. Take one.